ringside. Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas, and we're just about ready for action. Raging Bulls got Everybody's been waiting for these two to meet up. Now they do, as round one is underway. Raging Bulls landed a good, solid combination. Able to block that away, it was targeted for his head. He is damaged badly there. He may hit the floor. Good and yet another big shot comes in. The Beast is down. He went down hard. He gets. And if he wants to stay up, he's going to have to grab on. Kill a little time. There's the headshot, but he parries it away. He takes a shot and then commits to giving one right back. Watch the headshot. There's that overhand right. The Beast is cornered did a good job in that last round. They really... Oh, and there you go. How about that? He goes from being the victim to handing out the punishment. One, two, three, four, five. Down he goes, but he's going to continue on beating the count. The right hand comes into play by Raging Bull. Raging Bull's really in position to control things in this fight. If he can do what he did just there, and that's land a good, solid jab. And bang, and away he goes. Can he get up from this? He's done it before, but can he get up from a second time down? He went down from a big shot. Now he's got to have some big guts to move along. You're going to find out exactly what he's made of. The Beast is giving his opponent headaches here now. He's throwing punches, but he's able to block them away. Raging Bull's right hand did a nice job that time. That worked well for him. Well, that was his intention, and that's what he's doing. Not engaging in the fight, but clinching. And bang, and away he goes, able to land that power punch. Trying to force his way in that front door, and he got smacked with that door. He returned fire right there, and it works after being rocked. Now, he gets his man. At this point, it's not about the skills and the ability. Big, big shot comes crashing home. From absolutely out of nowhere to now on top of the world, he just floored him with that punch. Short one, maybe six inches. One, two, three, four, five, six. So now the question becomes, after that knockdown, and he has gotten up, how does he survive? So one of the ways he survives is if he's been taught. Have good habits, have good fundamentals been put there. You're going to find out right now he needs them right now. The final bell of what was a thrilling fight, Teddy. And this truly is a fight that could go either way, and you could make an argument either way. Well, let's see which way it went. Send it up to our ring announcer with the official decision. So all three judges hit.